People say it's from past experiences. People say you could be born one. Even some people try to fake it, but they cannot handle the chaos or the rage when the path is open. They do not understand the path before them. American Born Savage Productions presents The Way of a Savage. In a time long past, in a land far beyond the horizon, there lived a mighty warrior, his strength unmatched and unbeatable. Yet his power came at a cost, for those around him sought to exploit him for their own needs, leaving him devoid of true friendship and destined to live a solitary life. But one day as he wandered through the dense forest, he stumbled upon a Viking born in the land of America, a force to be reckoned with, wielding strength that could only match his own. Despite their similar power, the Vikings saw beyond the savages' might, and they became fast friends, sharing tales and laughter in each other's company. Their bond, though, was short-lived, as fate snatched the Viking away, leaving the savage heartbroken and alone once more. His grief consumed him, and he struggled to find solace in a world that had only ever brought him pain. As he journeyed on, he encountered three individuals, a village idiot, a drunk, and a Scythian, who begged for his help and generosity. However, he soon realized that they only wished to exploit his strength and kindness without putting forth any effort themselves. Frustrated and exhausted by the endless demands of others, the savage chose to embark on a journey to Valhalla, where he knew his friend awaited him. As he ventured forth, the path ahead brimmed with trials that pushed him beyond his bounds. Yet every obstacle, he stood resolute, determined to see his quest through the end. Along the winding way, he chanced upon fellow voyagers, a retired jester whose laughter echoed through the memories of the royal courts, and a minstrel whose melody stirred the very realms of the divine. In their midst, the wanderer found a glimmer of kinship, a balm for his solitary journey. As he neared his destination, his heart raced with anticipation. The sound of Valkyrie's horns echoing in the distance, finally he arrived at the gates of Valhalla, where his friend the Viking awaited him. They embraced one another like long lost brothers. The savage knew that he had found the true companion he had sought for so long. The savagery of the warrior was put to Odin's test. In the crucible of adversity, the warrior emerged victorious, earning the favor of the All-Father himself. Now the gates of Valhalla stood open, beckoning the mighty warrior forth. Together they battled side by side in the great halls of Valhalla, and the warrior knew that he had finally found a peace and companionship that had eluded him for so long. This is the way of a savage.